Okay, chair is going to be next to us. So posture, let's have a little check, all right? Shoulders back. This is our one time in the day we're going to really concentrate about us and our bodies to get everything else that's going on. Although it's a lovely sunny day today and it's been nice to get some sun on our faces. So shoulders back, standing lovely and tall, lifting the ribs away from the hips. Okay, try not to lock the knees. Always have the knees just a little bit soft, okay? And tucking that tailbone under. So just tilting, just a little tilt. So you start to feel your tummy is engaged a little bit more. You can give a little squeeze to your bottom. Okay, all right. So we're standing in that lovely position. We're going to do some breathing. And we're just going to take the arm up as we breathe in and down as we breathe out. So lovely deep breath. In through the nose if you can and out through the mouth. Let's do a couple more. So lovely reaching up. Let me just check. Can you all hear the music? Can you give me a thumbs up if you can hear the music? No. Okay. I've not shared it. That's my fault. I didn't think so. Can you hear it now? That's better, isn't it? Okay. So lovely and tall. Ah, now. One more this time. Okay. Good. So we're going to add a little side bend. As you take the arm up, you're just going to lean towards your chair and come back tall. Push onto your chair. Here we go. So breathe in. Little lean. And breathe out. Good. Making sure every time you come back and you stand lovely and tall. Little lean. Only go as far as you're comfortable. You just get a little stretch in your side. Let's do one more. So breathing in through the nose. And down. Good. Okay. We're going to add a little bit to it. This time, I'm going to show you. You're going to go up. You're going to do your lean. And then you're going to roll forward. Then you're going to stand tall. And you're going to bring your arm down. Yes? You've got a little lean. So we're going to go over. Then you lean forward. So you're bending in half. Then you're standing tall. And your arm comes down. How are we doing? So, up, a little lean, then forward, coming back up, and over. Good. Let's do that two more times. Here we go. Arm up and over. Lean your body forward, reaching out with that arm. Standing tall. Looking good. One more time. Here we go. Making this arm work all the time. Little lean forward, little bend at the hip, like you're hinging at the hip. Good. Okay. So, we're going to go up onto our toes, all right? So, we've just got one hand. If you're not feeling that confident, you can go up onto your toes facing your chair. But if you can do it with one hand, we're just going to lift up onto our toes. So, really push into the floor. Stay lovely and tall. Try not to lean forward. Go up in the air so that you're going straight. Straight up, not forward. So up we go. Really feel that in the calves and the ankles. Up we go. Looking good. Taking that breath in as you go up. Out as you come down. So everything can be done to the breath. Up and down. A couple more times. Up and down. You might even feel your glutes working as you go up. So squeeze the bottom. One last time. Up we go. Wonderful. Good. So we're making it a little bit hard now. We're going to take the feet nice and wide. So the feet can point out, okay? Naturally, when you open your legs up a little bit more, your feet go out at an angle. They don't stay facing the front. And then your knees go out on top of them. We've got a little bit of support. We're just going to put our arms up to the front or our arm up to the front as we go down. Now you go as deep as you want. If it's just a little bend here is enough for you, and that's all you want to do, that's fine. You want to go a little bit deeper, nice wide open legs, you can really work those hips and get those nice and deep. So what we're gonna think about now as we come up, I want you to really squeeze your bottom as you come back up and see if you can help. So your bottom is squeezing as you stand up. Keeping that chest up as much as you can. Remember the old bean bag on the head. You don't want the bean bag to drop off. So we're just going to do a few more of these, four more. 
squeeze in the bottom as we go. Up, squeeze, move off. Looking good. Rest if you need to, if it's hurting your knees or anything. Good. Lovely. Well done. Give those legs a little shake. Nice. If they ever hurt, just make sure you're sitting back and that you're not going forward. Can you see the difference? All my weight is going down through my knees. Whereas if I sit back, push my bottom back, then you take the weight off your knees. Okay? All right. So, we're going to do some of our little knee lifts. So, we're just lifting the knee up to the front. So, we're just lifting, bending the knee, trying to stay nice and tall, lifting that knee towards you, giving it a little bend, making the hip work and the outside of the thigh. Good. One more time. Lovely. Now we're going to go out to the side. So hips stay flat. We don't tilt. We don't chuck the leg right out. We just do a little lift to the side. Good. Making sure it works that bottom. Again, those bottoms go to sleep when we sit a lot. So we need to wake them up. They really do help with our posture, believe it or not. A little squeeze as it goes out. Take your arm out if you want to. That just works the arm. Two more. Good. Well done. Last one. Okay, so you can do two things. You can face the chair if you want to lean forward because we're going to go out the back. And we're going to do the same out the back. Or you can stay if you are and just lean forward. Oh, I've just kicked the wall, so I better do this. <laughs> okay, you ready? So we're just going to take that leg. Drop it down, take it out, stretch it. You can just bend like I am as it drops to the floor. We're just lifting, squeezing that bottom as it goes up. So, here, little squeeze. Good. How's that feel? Should feel that bottom starting to work now. Let's do four more. Here we go. One. Two. Three, four, last one. Oh, well done. Okay. And just give those legs a little shake out. We've got one more before we change sides and then we'll repeat everything on the other side. Give our little tap here and swing round. So it just gets that hip to start opening up and moving. So just take it carefully if you've got any bad hips. So we just so try for the body not to just move too much yeah can you see so you're just keeping everything nice and still and the only thing that really moves is that leg yeah if you can't take it off the floor you can just swing it around dragging your toe on the floor or you can tap tap tap, tap. waking those legs up isn't it one more time and around you go Good, and march them out. Lovely. Let's change the chair, or you move, whichever way is easier for you. It's easier for me to move my chair. Okay, so we're going back to the top again, starting a fresh. So where do we start? Just check that posture again. You stood nice and tall. Tummy's tucked in, elbow under, soft knee, shoulders back, and we're going to do that breathing. So we're not adding the side bend just yet. So you're going to breathe in and breathe out. Lifting that arm up, lovely. See so if you can get it right up by the ear and breathe out. Breathe in. Maybe look up to the ceiling, get your neck to move as well. Two more of these. Last one. Breathing in and out. Okay, very similar. We're going to add that side bend. So we take it up. And we just pause at the top and then down again. Lovely. And over we go. So this is really easy. It's just something you can do if you find yourself standing in the kitchen waiting for the tea to cook. You can just do a few little moves, can't you? A little side bend. A little bit of deep breathing. Let's do two more. Here we go. Lovely. We're going to add the lean forward in a second. So let's take it from here. So we're reaching up. Then we go forward. We just bend ourselves at our hips. Then we stand tall again. 
and we'll take our arm down. So if you're working the arm as well, over we go. Some little side bend, reach forward, bend in half, coming back up, lovely and tall. Good. So it's getting our back to move. Over we go. Bend in half, really pull that tummy in. You might find a little stretch in the back of your leg while you're doing that as well. Here we go. So when you lean forward, you might think, oh yes, I can feel that in the back of my leg. Two more. Here we go. Over. Forward. Coming back up. Last one. Oh, I can feel the arm working. That's really working the arm as well, isn't it? Just keep the back going. Last one. Down we come. Well done. Give that shoulders a little roll now. Feel those shoulders working. So up onto our toes, okay? So we can do that facing the chair if we want to, if we feel a little bit more secure, or you can stay sideways, just coming up onto the toes. That's it. Squeezing everything as you come up, so stay really solid. If you want to try balancing, then obviously take your hand off the chair. You don't need to have the hand on the chair if you don't have to. Coming up, let's do two more, here we go. Really working those calves, ankles, thighs. Last one. I think that was three. <laughs> okay, right, we're going to take that step out nice and wide. So take these steady if you need the hurting at all. Make sure that the feet are pointing out and the knees go over, but you stick back as you do it. Okay, here we go. Let's just take the arm up. So if you are a little bit more supple than you feel, you can go nice and deep and it will really open up the inside of the legs there and do so, but only do it if you're ready to. Yeah, good the back. With the knees, feel it at all, just move the bottom back over the heels. You've got your chair for support. So four more, here we go. This is really looking good, keeping those chest up, that's lovely. Super. Some of you aren't using chairs, which is great, keeping that balance just using both hands. Last one. I think that's one more for luck. Good. Excellent. Okay. Give yourself a little shake. So we got our little knee lift, last, last set of these. So we're just going to be lifting the knee up, bending the knee, and bringing it up to you. Wherever you feel comfortable, bring that knee up. If you want to try it like a balance, Take the hand away from the chair and all the body will start working a little bit more so you can challenge yourself. Little knee lift, two more. One and two, lovely. Out to the side, keeping those hips nice and flat. You feel that little squeeze on the outside here, using the outside of the leg. This is really good, well done everybody. Those hips are lovely and flat really got this one. You feel that working there a little. Tension on the side. Two more. Good. There we go. So give them a little wiggle. So you have two options here. You can either face the chair and we're going to do out the back or you can carry on leaning forward. I keep kicking the wall so I'm going to go this way. So just take the body forward so that you don't pinch the spine at the bottom there. Leaning forward. Pull the tummy in. Again, if you wanted to do this without the chair, you can just get into a balanced position and lift and lower the leg. And do it without. Two more. And last one. Good, well done. Sometimes that standing leg gets a little bit sort of tired, doesn't it? So give it a little shake. Okay. One last one, guys. We've just got our little tap to the front, tap to the back. Just moving that hip, getting it to open up. If at all that's getting too much on your standing leg, just give it a rest. We've worked them hard today. We've got all fun moves coming next, so we'll be fine. Tap in. And tap in. Last time, there we go. And there, and just really give those 
Arms and legs and the body are lovely shape. Well done. Brilliant. Okay, so quite intense warm up, really, isn't it? But you all look lovely as ballerinas, so thank you for that. <laughs> Let me give you a recap. You do whatever you want to do, is the first thing I want to say. So if you just want to do this, you just do that. As long as you're moving, as long as you're smiling, I really don't care. Okay? All right. So never think you have to always do my moves or the ones that I'm doing. You really don't. I'm just giving you a guide. So just don't worry about it. Okay? But we're going to try and do our little walk with our stick as if we're going across the stage. Yeah. So we've got our stick. Just And then we're going to go the other way. So it's just a few moves either way. Then we do a little circle. So that's like a little balance. But if you just want to keep your foot touching the floor, you can. And then we do a big circle with the hands. And again, it's just rubbing that foot along the floor. OK, and then we go back to our cane. Yeah, back to our cane. All right. Then we do a move that takes it over the top. And I usually say something like over the top. There we go. And we do a couple of those, just little moves and tap out to the side. But even if you just stand there and want to move your arms, that's fine. And then we do a little push down, push down push down, push down, okay? Those are the moves. There might be a little bit of this later on. We might pretend we're doing our sort of can-can moves across the stage, okay? But that's basically the move. Okay, here we go. Let's give it a go. Get that music on. And I crank it up a little bit. Okay, are you ready? Here we go, got our cane, and we're gonna go. Kicking across the stage. Hands on the hip. Start and the other side. The news. I'm leaving today. Back to the first side. Here we I go. Want to leave. be yes. a part of it. New York, New York. A little circle round. Circle round. And a big one. Are longing to stay. And another one. Okay, back to the cane. Right through the very heart. And again. New York, New York. Good. Little circle. So a circle. And a big one. In a city that doesn't sleep. Over the top. Here we go. And find I'm king of the hill. And the other way. Top of the heap. These Got little town again. Here we go. blues are other melting side. away. I'll make Those little circles, the circle. As if you're on the set, big one. New York. If I can Over the top. Make it there, I'll make it. One more. Anywhere. I'm it's up that. to it's you. Sick. New York. New York. Good. Little jazz hands, little kick. On the top, so. New York, those little circles, New York, circles, big ones. To wake up and again, city that over never we go. Sleeps. And, find and again, I'm main number one, top of the list, king of down. the hill, a number. So we've got our tilted hat. These little town blues. It's a bit slower. Can you do it? Oh, Other side. Melting away. Give it away. I'm and again. I'm going to make a brand new start oh, it's a bit of, of a balance. It. It we can do New York. And Over we go. Nice and slow. Make it there. I'm gonna make it Push anywhere. It it's up to you, New York. Big finish. New Brilliant. Well done. That was lovely. Oh. Let me show you. So the moves for hound dog. Well done. That was, that was really good, that one. So we've got nothing but a hound dog. And then we do a bit of the leg. 
and the hand, a little bit of that, a bit of Elvis Presley with his leg, little hound dog, leg, can you do it? Get that hip going, yeah. And then it's sort of out, out, in, in, and a do 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 Yeah, you remember it. Let me do a little bit of a kick. I always call it the posh move because it's sort of got the little hands that do a little do, yeah. Okay. And then we do again the out, out, in, in, do 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 do. Um, and then we have like, I call it the flapper girl. So it's just basically lifting your arms up and down again. Yeah. Okay. Let's give it a go. Here we go. So this is my Lock in. Get that hip going. You ain't up but a hound dog. And again. Ready to go. Out, 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 in, in. Jamie. Little posh move. So it's alternate leg. A lift and kick. Are you ready? Hands go out. Those legs. Good. Get those hips going. Out the hands go. And shake. Posh move. Oh, no, here we go. Slap the girl. So, just taking the arms up, however you want. That's it. Get the body moving. And up. And again. So, going up. Good. Give it a kick. Hands out. So, out, out, in, in. Hound dog. Oh no, I keep forgetting. Slap the girl. Take those hands up. And down. And up again. You can turn around if you want. Hit. Rock it all the time. And again. Another time. Yeah. You ain't no friend of mine. Woo! Excellent. Well done, well done. It's not a piece of music you've probably heard of, but we're just going to do some cool dancing to it. So we're going to have a little sway. When boys go, here's what they say. And then we're going to roll those shoulders. See, that's it. So just well, roll the shoulders. Right, you can take the arms like back if you want. That's it. Lovely. That's just rolling forward. Good. When and then we're just going to swing again. To shine like you've had too much wine at Samori. This time I want you to roll them forward, so it's a little bit Bells different. Will ring, forward. Ting -a -ling, ting -a -ling, a -ling, and you'll Taking the arms round. And then we're going to swing again. Good. Hearts will play a tippy tippy tay, tippy tippy tay, nice like a guitar in the You know our forward and back that we do. So we're gonna go when forward. the stars and make open. you drool Just like a positive like as a Nice and flowing When you dance, dance the down the more. street With a cloud at your feet You're in love yeah. Okay, so we're gonna do that hand Where we straighten that leg out Bend and it you know and you're not dreaming Have a lovely stretch Sit right back Want to hold your chair, you can do that. Change sides, other leg goes out, sitting back. You can sing along if you don't. That's yeah. more. Okay, so that's the swing again. That's the more. So, grabbing your chair if you want to, we have to do a little stretch. Just going to grab hold of the foot. If you can't do that, 
Just move to the music while you're having your friends. Good. Down the street with the Lovely. Okay. So I just want us to stand nice and comfortably. And we're just going to stretch up, stretch down. And a little side bend. And you know stretch up, dream. stretch down. Little side bend. One more each side. Excusing me, but you and see I'm back in old Napoli That's amore, amore So just a little That's amore Ta-da <laughs> So, I want you to give yourselves a big hug Alright, because you deserve it So we're bringing the back We're opening up the shoulder blades we're coming forwards and we're going to just round our backs down, taking our elbows down towards our knees and then we're going to sit up. Then you're going to release the arms and do the complete opposite. Hold the back of your chair and sit up lovely and tall. Massive difference between that stretch opening up here on the shoulders. So let's go again. Hug, open up the shoulder blades, lean forward. Sitting nice and tall. Open out those arms, come across. Wonderful. Good. And we're just going to relax those shoulders a little bit. So I want you to just drop your shoulders, nice long neck. Your ear is going to just drop. Drop your head to one side, keeping the shoulders down. Then you're going to put your chin onto your chest. We're going to pop the other ear towards the shoulder. Okay, and then you're going to look up to the ceiling. Last one, we're going to put our hands on our shoulders and give them a nice circle. Backwards. And then forwards. And bring your hands down and give yourself a clap. <laughs> 